y'all. Ooh, it's on my lip. <laughs> I got some grits on my lip. This vlog is starting off very much all over the place. I tried to bring my GoPro to vlog, and it was dead. I opened up my camera just now to try to vlog. Me walking to the garage and introducing the, introducing the vlog to y'all. And why is it saying battery exhausted? How did I not charge any of my devices? My phone, to be honest, wasn't even charged this morning, but when I cooked breakfast, I put it on the charger, so now it's charged up. But today's gonna be me running errands for um, festivities that's gonna be going on tonight. I'm looking a hot mess. I'm looking like I'm running errands. This is the fit. This the fit. Nothing really. Nothing really going on. Just trying to. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm racing against time right now. So I'm gonna get in the car and charge my camera, hopefully. And then run these errands and show y'all a little bit of the glimpse of the errands I'll be running. Um, today we're preparing for my sister's festivity. She's having a Christmas shindig. Today is the Friday the 2nd, 10:49 a.m. I can't see it. And um, where uh, the shindig starts at 9 p.m. But I don't get to work until 8.30, hopefully. You don't run over, but we'll see. But yeah, I'll be taking guys along with me today and tonight. So I hope you guys enjoy. And yeah, I'm gonna head to the car now. Ciao. I was supposed to be done left at 10 o'clock. It's way past 10. I should've got up way earlier. I'm tripping. I hope it's not a lot of traffic today. It is Friday. I don't think it's gonna be a lot of traffic. I don't think so. But yeah, I'm making goodie bags. So I'm gonna pick up some things to put in the goodie bag, and I also want to order a um, a wing platter. There's a spot called oh, what's the name of it? It has the pineapples. It's something something wings, but I want to order the platter and have it delivered. Hopefully, that way I don't feel about picking it up because it's like a 20 minute drive from where I'm at right now, and it's gonna be going outside of the city of Atlanta to go get it. It's like in a different little county or something like that. I don't know. We're gonna figure it out. I'll update y'all once I get in the car. Okay, girl, take a breath, take a breath, girl. It's gonna be all right. <laughs> it's gonna be, do I push or pull? Can I even open the door? There we go. All right. I'll come back to y'all with some updates. Hopefully I'll have some boo roll and not forget to vlog. See y'all later. <laughs> I made it to the Dollar Tree. Why the Dollar Tree 13 minutes from where I'm staying at the Airbnb? I have 25 minutes of dang of space on my SD card. So I'm gonna delete some more footage or buy another one. I might just buy another one while I'm out. But uh, okay. So what I'm about to do now is call the wing place real quick and see if they can deliver to my sisters. And I'm gonna go ahead and pay it over the phone, hopefully, because that's another, like I said, it's another 20 minute drive. I sent it on my TikTok. My boyfriend actually found it. So let me see if I can find it again. If I don't buy another SD card, I'll just vlog off my phone, but I don't have time to go pick up another one because that might be a whole task in itself, honey, and I don't have time for that. Right now, it is 11.14. Um, okay, let's see, where is it at? That's Land Cops in Atlanta. It's called Taste Buds Atlanta, so I'm gonna call them right now. I'm gonna look them up and call them Taste Buds Atlanta. Taste Buds Wings, I believe. Oh yeah, Taste Buds Wings. That Belvedere Park, Georgia. Oh, they're closed right now. I actually did this yesterday. What time did they open? Mm. What time did they open? Open at. <gasps> Bye, y'all. See y'all in a minute. Wish me luck, child. I'm on a time crunch. Gotta go to work today. I gotta make calls. I gotta get people to deliver things. I done got packages delivered too to my sister's apartment that I want to put in the goodie bag. And it's supposed to get here today. Is it's going to get here today? I don't know. I got it from Tasha Lux Boutique and um, I got her lashes, the baddie, and lip gloss for myself. But I got lashes to put in the goodie bags because we love wearing lashes over here. I don't know about y'all, but we love wearing lashes. Okay, I'm about to go inside of Dollar Tree. There it is. So I'm going to go in there. Oh, I can't turn the camera. There we go. I'm going to go in there real quick see what I can find. So excited about all the options. So they have these bags that are in sets of threes for like $1.25 or I could get the uh, 20 piece count for a dollar. I think I'm going to just do that because it also has a little um, tie to the top and it's more space. So this is usually my go-to when I do goodie bags. Anyways, the stock style of uh, material versus the box because it's going to get thrown away anyway. So I'm just going to get these or I can get the smaller one that's more 
I guess, unisex. Some people it can be a co-ed party. Boys and girls, ladies and their men. I don't know. Well, that's cute, the sunglasses. I mean, the glasses. Sunglasses. I also need something festive to wear. So I might get the hat. And I don't know which one should I get for Juwan. He doesn't want to wear any of these, I don't think. <laughs> So maybe a necklace or something festive that'll work not too much but still a little something a little pizzazz yeah i'm gonna look through this and i'll let you guys know so we're gonna go see if they have what i need in here so here is the mall i didn't really get a chance to show you guys before coming in because i was rushing and trying to park and it was hectic trying to park but i made it i'm gonna show you guys my get back to the car i did a good job back in a girl all right y'all this is my last and final stop hopefully i get everything i need out of this target child i didn't even do too much at the mall but i have was deaf my titties is waiting for sure walk up the car all right so coming in here i'm just trying to get some little gift cards they got the big body bins back there i'm trying to get a few gift cards to go inside the goodie bags and then um i don't know do they have a crispy cream crispy cream <laughs> gift cards in target because um my, my sister let me see y'all out i can't i need to figure out how to do this my sister's oh i look hot mess <laughs> my sister's uh boyfriend's into playstation as i'm sure y'all know a lot of folks that are and i was either gonna get him a playstation you know little ten dollar twenty dollar gift card to go inside of his giddy bag or i was gonna get him krispy kreme donuts because they say they eat that all the time so one or the other i'm gonna get one of those and then, um, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Starbucks is per usual. I could easily get Starbucks for um, my sister and my cousin. Starbucks gift card. They would love that. But let's look for the boys first because they're going to be the hardest to shop for because I'm not a boy and I don't know what boys want most of the time. Especially these boys. They're very low maintenance, which we love. We love that. We love that. So here we are. So we have gift cards. Are these just Visa gift cards though? We have Home Depot. My uncle would love that. Apple Store. That'd be nice. But I don't. I don't think they're really into Apple like that. Like I said, Starbucks. You never can really lose with that. Subway, DoorDash. That's different. What's down here? Domino's, Chipotle. I don't see Krispy Kreme, Cheesecake Factory, $50. Is that the minimum or the max that you can put on it? Oh, here go the gaming stuff. I don't know though. I don't know what I'm doing here. Twitch? I don't know if they play the Twitch. Where's the PlayStation ones? Oh, there it is. It says, okay, this one's a $50 and then that one's a hundred. Total wine. Spotify. Hmm. Oh, my car charged my camera up to 100%, so that's cool. I don't want to do $50 for the PlayStation. Is it just... Can I go less than that? Where's the cheaper ones? Because that's doing too much for a little light goodie. This is light. We're trying to keep it real light over here. For the guys. So, yeah, that's how... $50. I don't know about that. We ain't balling over here. I ain't balling like that. <laughs> uh-uh. They're not my man. Cinemark. I don't know. I'm going to keep looking and then I'll come back and let you guys know what I end up deciding to get. Because I don't know what they play. I don't know. Thank you. Thank you. Just like my camera is cute. See, I'm going to come back and let y'all know what I'm doing. I'm going to keep looking around though. I need to concentrate. you guys what i got briefly before i put it in together and i'm still on a slight time crunch but not as much as i was previously thank goodness but yeah i'm gonna show you guys what i got from dollar store and i'll put if i remember to i'll put the uh prices of each item on the screen but you know it's a dollar and some change more than likely unless oh no there's something i got that was actually more than a dollar 
So don't let them fool you, honey. It ain't dollar stuff for real. Not more. Like, not like it used to be. It used to be straight a dollar. Nothing else above that. But where is the receipt? I'll put it on the screen if I remember too, like I said. So I got candy canes. You're gonna see these. You won't be surprised like everybody else. <laughs> Do you want to be surprised or you don't care? You don't care? I got candy canes. These are the regular, you know, candy canes, red and white. Swirls going down them. There's 12 of them. I'm gonna throw a couple of them in the bag. And then I got blue because Ebony's boyfriend likes blue. So I got blue for him. <laughs> um, and then I got these necklaces I'm gonna put in the bag just because, you know, just because they make noises. They're festive. Everybody can put them on if they want to at the end of the night. They can take it home, they can throw it away. They can actually wear them the rest of the, the month because it's still gonna be Christmas time the rest of this month. Oh, it's December 2nd if I haven't already said that. Wait, I need to do a video. I mean, a picture real quick. Thumbnail, potential thumbnail picture. <laughs> okay. All right, so. I showed y'all that, and then here's the goodie bags. I showed you guys some goodie bags inside Dollar Tree, and this is the ones that I decided to go with because they're pretty neutral. You know, snowflakes, that's cute, festive, simple. Gets the point across. And yeah, two of them came together for the next, this two of them, so I got one for each couple. So cute, right? It's super cute. And then let's see what else I got from the Dollar Tree. So I got this, um, they call it a thick garland. It's pretty, it's white, it's pink. Um, it has different textures to it. I'm pretty sure people use this probably to like go on their tables or go across their doors to decorate it. It's called Chunky Tinsel Garland. And I think this was actually $3. Yeah, it was $3 for this. Um, and it's really thick and I want to get something to like fill up the bags to make them look more thick and like stuff was actually in it because I couldn't find the things that I wanted. And then um, that was the last item from Target. I got, was that the last item from Target? No, it wasn't. Then I got this for myself, put on my head. <laughs> it might be cute, hopefully it doesn't hurt my head. Usually I, headbands hurt my head because they be too tight. I don't have a big head, but they just make them for children, I believe, so they just be super tight. But I got this, thought that was super cute. Green and brown. They had all kinds of different headbands, but I got that one. And I got this, this is like a bracelet. I'm gonna open it up right now to show you guys. It's like a bracelet that you can put on your wrist or your ankle. And you know, it'll just make the little noises when you talk with your hands or you know, when you move or play a game or just walk around. <laughs> They'll hear it, it's just really cute and festive. Green is how it looks. And then I got this for Nola and it makes a noise. <laughs> so it's literally a Christmas tree with lights around it, but it looks like a dog at the same time. It's long, you know, and chewable. So she's gonna love that. Like I said, I'll put the prices on the screen once I look at the receipt. And then I went to Sephora and got some, you know, I got some COVID, COVID type, keep clean type type of stuff. Like, you know, be safe, be clean. So I got these to go into the goodie bags for the girls. I don't think the guys really care about stuff like this, but I've been wanting to try out Touchland. And I think they're just so cute. The package is so cute. I got it in Wild Watermelon Mist and Appalicious. And then I also got it in um, Rainwater and another watermelon. So I think that's really cute from Sephora. I, was, I couldn't find a lip gloss from NYX. Um, and I also got this for my man's goodie bag, honey. He's gonna really appreciate this, I know it. Y'all see me going to the store. So I got this for him. Super useful, super useful. I hope, we'll see. He'll let me know. He will let me know. And then, uh, the last thing that I got, oh. I also got the gift cards, hold on. These, um, they didn't have lemon drops, but I got Deep Eddy Lemon. I really like these because they're not super strong. I feel like anybody could just take it back real quick. It says real lemon, distilled 10 times, gluten-free, 
But yeah, I love me a lemon drop. So I got this to put in the goodie bag. Because we got to have a goodie bag with a shot in it. And I meant to get scratch offs. So that would be fun to have. But I forgot to do that. So it's okay. And then I also got gift cards from Target. So I got these for uh, my sister and my cousin. And then one's going to go to uh, my other cousin. And then one's going to go to Glenn. Originally, I was trying to get Glenn a Crystals gift card. But they don't have gift cards for Crystals. And then I got this one for my sister's boyfriend pretty sure it's gonna appreciate that and i got this one for my boyfriend because he goes there all lot. i think he's gonna appreciate that too so i'm gonna go ahead and put all these together make them look real cute and i'll show you guys the finished results once i get done so i'll see you guys and i'll also be dressed up and ready for the party so i'll show you guys my outfit as well for the occasion and yeah i'll put my nails on too because your girl has time now what time is it 6 44 we don't have to be there until um 8 30 or 9 o'clock i think is when she said it's gonna start but you know we're probably gonna get a little bit after depending on how fast we get ready but i'm gonna go ahead and turn my camera off all right y'all so here's the goodie bag with all the stuff in it and of course i just put nola's in there um i have eight minutes left on this space so i'm gonna vlog if i do vlog anything it'll be on my phone because i don't have turn around because i don't have a whole lot of space on the ssd card right now i was supposed to get another one today but i completely forgot to get one. I'm working with only two SSD cards right now. So when I get more, I'll be better. I'm, I'm, I'm getting better at this, you guys. Bear with me. Bear with me. So here is my outfit. Um, I was trying to get more Christmas vibes, but it ended up being more New Year's vibe. But you know, it's still the same holiday. It's still the same, basically the same month, right? <laughs> but yeah, so I'm wearing this uh, skirt I got from Target. It's like $22. A shirt that I got from, it's a bodysuit that I got from Amazon, probably like $10. I'm wearing these boots that I got from Coach. Can you guys see? Join, you want to show me your outfit? Or no? And then also, Jamal went and picked some more treats for Nola. She's going to love it. You want to show me your outfit? I don't know if we're back far. Can you see your outfit in there? Polo, Yeezys, yep, yep. I think we did a good job coordinating together. What do y'all think? Y'all can y'all even see our faces? <laughs> Ooh, my bad. Let me tilt it up. Okay, come back. That might be better. That's better. <laughs> can you see yourself? Yeah. You want to get a thumbnail? All right, see you at the party. <laughs> hey guys, so I just wanted to come on here and close out the vlog. As I'm editing, I realized I did not close it out. I didn't even really show you guys too much of the festivities, but it's okay, because I'm gonna tell you about it. So basically we had a lot of fun. Point blank period, we had a lot of fun. We played games, we had different snacks. Um, speaking of snacks, as I posted in the beginning of the vlog in the text if you read it, I ordered some wings from DoorDash. Not DoorDash, Uber Eats for the party, right? And it was from this place, I mentioned it in the vlog. And I even called them before ordering it to make sure I can get the wings that I wanted at a certain time that I wanted in. And then make sure I could order the amount of wings that I wanted and not to have two different orders going on and tell them I want four of this, not four, ten of this, ten of this flavor, ten of that flavor, ten of this flavor. Because I wanted a hundred wings, I believe. Was it 150? I can't remember. One or the other. I believe it was 100 wings. I wanted 100 wings for the party because it's gonna be a lot of us there. And um, tell me why after all that, me doing my due diligence and making sure everything was organized and set in place and it was gonna get dropped off at the location when it needs to be dropped off. So I thought I was gonna be at work. And um, tell me why, tell me why the Uber Eats delivery person ran off with the wings, 100 wings. And I'm in Atlanta, so it's like, I shouldn't be shocked, shouldn't be surprised, but it's like, why? Like, you knew, you knew that that was for a party. No one else is ordering wings, unless it's, for, not that many, unless it's for a party. Like, five count, ten count, maybe a twenty count, but a hundred wings, you want to run off with a hundred wings. And it's like, I was just so upset that I didn't even put that apart in the vlog, but I wanted to share that with you guys because there still ended up being a happy ending with the party and my boyfriend actually went out and got some more wings last minute at that last minute on a saturday or friday night 
he went out and got some wings, 100 wings with different flavors and brought it back to where we were at. So he saved the day per usual. How are you feeling? Okay. Everything's there? Yes. Everything's Thank there. you. He saved the day. But it was just the fact that we had to even deal and deal with that and go through that was just so irritating to me. It took me a minute to calm down. I was over it. I wanted to really go find that lady and just like I was ready. I was ready. If I never been ready, I was ready that day. And she on my list. She on my list. I believe I took screenshots too. So if you ever see this person picking up your food. Be ready. <laughs> be ready to be ready to be gone because she finna snatch it up and run away with it. The thing that happened was she um basically reported to the app that she was having issues with delivery. Mind you, I was tracking it because you know when you order food or order Instacart, order anything, it lets you know when the food is ready, who's on their way to pick it up, their contact information, and I messaged her too, I believe, and um the time they're supposed to be getting to you. So she was like 10 minutes away from where she needed to be to drop the food off. And that's when it sent me a notification saying that my driver had issues with her delivery. Mind you, people are out here for nests and I understand, but I just didn't expect it to happen because it's Christmas, it's holiday time. It's holiday time, but I guess people gotta feed their kids. People just greedy, I don't know. At the end of the day, I'm just grateful and blessed that that wasn't like a dire need emergency for us to have food because it was for a party in the day but still it's just very inconvenient and unfortunate and i didn't deserve that we we didn't deserve that as a whole so for anybody out there who's door dashing uber eating instacarting beware or be square and for those of you who are actually delivering the food please be mindful that if this was you you would not like that so please don't be doing people like that it's not right it's not funny it's not cute period but yeah, that's all. I just want to come here and tell y'all that we ended up having a really great time. We played um, games on the Oculus, if you don't know about, um, what is it called? It's a squirrel game. Acron, A-C-R-O-N. And it's very fun for people who are into games or if you're at a party and you're hosting and you want everybody to interact. And it's an easy way for them to use their device, like their actual phone, and use the Oculus. Very fun, very fun. And we also made little ornaments too. I'll insert that. It's so cute. My sister had little activities too. And we brought activities. My cousin brought some, um, she, I think she brought taboo, something like that. I don't know, taboo. But yeah, it was a good time. The drinks were good. We had sangrias. Um, there was a charcuterie board, a charcuterie board, <laughs> as I like to call it. And yeah, it was a good time. I enjoyed myself. I feel like everybody there enjoyed themselves. My boyfriend enjoyed himself. And we left with some goodie bags to my sister. Um, my cousin actually made us shirts. So we ended up wearing that um, on Christmas Day. We went, to the, we went to Christmas dinner and day and church and all that stuff. But yeah, um, I've been sitting on this video for a while, y'all. It's January 2nd, 3rd. This video should be out by Sunday, by the time y'all see this, hopefully by Sunday, but I've been sitting on this vlog. It's been more than 95%, about 95% finished edited, but I just had to insert the closing because I did not film it. So yes, hope you guys enjoyed my video and my videos from my past years. And I hope you guys stick with me throughout 2023. I hope everyone had a safe, relaxing holiday, New Year's Eve, Christmas, all that jazz. And I hope you guys are ready for this year, honey, because it's coming no matter what. Ready or not, here it comes. But I'll see you guys in my next videos. I love y'all. Bye.